Today I'm going to show you the K5 with AA batteries. It doesn't seem to be that well known that the battery grip can take AA batteries. It takes six of them. The reason being is that the K5's lithium ion battery is 7.2 volts. So you need six of them to match or get similar voltage. Most of the entry level cameras can take four AA batteries right directly into the body, but the K5 and similar semi pro high end cameras need more voltage because they probably have faster processor, you know, they do more frames per second, burst rates and all that. So I'll show you how this all works. It comes with a separate tray just for the AA batteries. It loses the SD card slot, lithium ion one. You put the battery here and then you have a storage area for the SD card. So you've got six slots here. Just follow the directions. You flip it over and do the same thing. So we've got that set. Now I do not have a battery inside the K5. Lock the camera down into the grip, slide the tray in, just go upside down, takes a little bit of force because there's some spring action in there. So we got six, we've got six AA batteries in here running the K5 by themselves. Let's try a burst rate. Put it into manual focus. Hit the buffer. I should probably put a card in there, but see it works just the same as with the lithium ions. Pretty convenient if you ever get into a situation where you're regular rechargeables run out of charge. I've never personally had that situation. I have quite a few uh, rechargeable batteries of the lithium ion type, but the grip is definitely helpful in that situation if you see you'll possibly need that option. So that was the K5 with the battery, battery grip and AA batteries. Thanks.